Hey guys, a very short update on the price of Bitcoin. As you see, we went broke downwards from this uh, ascending channel uh, very sharp after we test this area of this uh, support of this channel is bottom uh, part and then we uh, reached 23.6 percent by fibonacci well actually it depends on uh, which area you count as the bottom as the low lowest point so it's it was a very short we're very uh, sharp week here so maybe uh, 38.2 but it doesn't really matter the thing is that uh, if you consider this drop covering this um, growth then it's it's actually very close to uh, fill it entirely and as soon as we'll uh, reach five thousand eight hundred dollars i would say that the test of this level would be very crucial whether we will have a pullback or we will continue to go lower and in that case there are two possible scenarios I, I would say that either we have a double top here and then the breakdown from the area of five thousand eight hundred would lead to a continuation of the drop or we might have another um arise here and then form a kind of a um, head and shoulders pattern and then again if we'll test the same level over once again then we'll make uh, uh, we'll have a chance that it will be broken downwards with a continuation of the drop to like below five thousand um, dollars pro probably like something like that and yeah it also would depend on how the um, traditional markets will be um, perform will perform in the next uh, day on Monday so whether they will open with a negative sentiment or positive I would say that it's very likely that will go uh, lower and Bitcoin will follow and they also have some uh, bull bearish divergences already we had some bearish divergence here on a four hour time frame you see but then right now we already have a kind of a bullish one although there is a, a low over here but it might play out in fact it didn't uh, really react with this area and we continue to test the level of six thousand um, dollars over and over again so i would say it's more likely it will be it got broken to the downside but in any case we need to see how the five thousand eight hundred dollar level play out on uh, the other hand we also have this bearish sentiment over here you see this nine uh, green nine on TD sequential after that we saw the red one which basically is a bearish sign so we are continuing to go lower it was two thousand three hundred dollars when I posted this now it is uh, already tested six thousand uh, dollars a couple of times and also stochastic stochastic RSI had this bearish bearish um, crossover uh, on the MACD histogram turn to, um, to, to to go lower as well after reaching this uh, high so everything on the daily time frame even looks pretty bearish to me and as you see we can't reach the area of seven thousand five hundred dollars from which I would expect uh, to have a short uh, position well quite reasonable one but uh, you see market doesn't allow you to go short it actually doesn't allow you to go long for with a relatively uh, reasonable uh, risk to reward ratio from here I I would say that we might go short but it didn't play out we went higher from here we might go uh, expect to uh, go higher and then open short again it didn't play out and so on and so forth so not so much uh, in terms of the possibilities to the entry it's not a financial advice just my personal opinion I will see how the price will react with five thousand eight hundred dollars if it will be a breakdown uh, at this area then I will take a short position after the retesting of this area and uh, again the rejection of five thousand dollars eight five thousand eight hundred dollars to the downside other way around if we will have the uh, pull back to the upside then I will see how it uh, will go either lower or higher if higher then it might be the long position if uh, it will test five thousand eight hundred dollars and breaking it then it will be the short position in my opinion again I will keep you updated on telegram and Twitter as usual and so far probably that is it uh, I must say that I'm um, moving right now and to, to the new place and uh, maybe my videos will not be that frequent as I would like them to be but please bear with me I will keep you updated as usual on Telegram and Twitter. Links in the description if you want to join. Uh, go ahead and do that. And yeah, that is it pretty much for today. Um, I hope it is useful and safe trading, guys. Goodbye.